Okay. Hello, dear friends. Good morning. Such a beautiful, beautiful morning. So I would like to take this opportunity to share with you my progress in my uh, math class, in my uh, online teaching. So I made a website and uh, I do some uh, uh, Google Slides, Google Site and Google Forms so we can take a look. First, we can see the website. And now it is a, a full functioning website. So I open up to it. And, uh, oh, I do not need, I already opened it up. Anyway, now we will see this. So it's a full function web website. And uh, I have learned to insert and to clean up something. I have learned to to change the, the background picture. This video is mainly to introduce so that you can come to this website. And uh, I name it fourth math class. I teach fourth grade math. And, um, and uh, uh, it used to be called Haiying's math class because this will be used for a lot of people. So I, uh, I put the title here in the uh, as fourth grade math instead of personal name. But on the website, you can see site at google.com and slash Yang Haiying. It's a Haiying's math class. It's different. I will put the link on the de description of this video. So uh, let's publish it. Now I publish it. You are not... No... Uh, unpublished change so we can just uh, uh, we can go back to editor and uh, I already did a publishing so we will view the published site you can take a look so it's color coded to begin with the color coding is the same as uh, my color coding of my Google sites so you can see my Google Sites and all these documents, all these Google Forms and the Google, um, Google Slides are color-coded. Color-coded. I'm using a lot of uh, uh, space, uh, cyberspace of my site. So how is this color-coded? Whole number, I take it as the the first step. So whole number is green and uh, fraction is blue. The next step is blue and the decimal is orange. You can see this orange or yellow color, orange. And then order of operation is uh, uh, order of operation and uh, measurement. Uh, order of operation, it belongs to a uh, whole number. Measurement in green and the geometry in purple and uh, word problem and test preparation as gray color. So um, it's more or less inspired by the ski piece. The, the green one is the easiest one and then blue and then red in Europe there is red when we ski in in Swiss uh, uh, 1800 uh, France or Swiss 1800 we have uh, a red piece and then black I do not have bl double diamond <laughs> and um, <coughs> geometry is kind of odd and curious and interesting so I put it purple color. Anyway, so this is the color of it. Now we go to my class. This is a published site. <coughs> so the front picture, I made it uh, um, every color. It is not so easy to see the sidebar browsing around, but it does not matter so much. Life is... Uh, is uh, when you go down, you can actually see it when you go, yeah. 
and all these links are clickable. Maybe I should change into green color and blue color, but I have not yet found a way to change the font color, to change the text color. I will try to figure it out. So you go to whole number, you can go from here or from here. It goes, it links to the same, same page. Let me blow it up to full screen. Good, that is better. So we can go to whole number. Did I say whole number is green? So whole number is green. I will need to add up some introduction in whole number. But whole number, it takes to exercise and lessons. Lessons are my videos of uh, whole number strategy. When you do uh, adding up, finding the last number to make it 10, to make it 100, and uh, multiplication strategy and order of operation, all these strategies and the practice. So small letter for whole number, so you know this is the section, and this one is mainly about lessons. So, And let's go to whole number exercise. So the exercise, you can see still green color. And you click on to each. This you will click to my Google form. But it goes to my Google form of taking the test, not editing my test. If I share the link of the edit, you will edit my form. No, you will not do that. You will go to these exercises. So order, o -O -O, order of operation. To differentiate a little bit, sometimes I add Chinese words because um, sometimes Chinese words is more precise. It shows very much more so in the fraction section. Let's see. This is, for example, let's click one of these uh, exercise. These are the multiples. You will take the, the, the quiz here. And there is not very much to explain about, so I didn't put much uh, about uh, uh, a video demonstration. Sometimes, for example, this order of operation, let's see if I have, uh, I do not have because it's relatively simple. Maybe I will add on um, sometime later, multiplication grouping, and it's uh, uh, it's simple by itself. 4 times 5 is 20, 20 times 6, so you can get it uh, uh, relatively easier. Okay, so this one we will go through here to go to, oh, oh, not this page. Let me close up this page so that we do not be disturbed by it. So whenever you get lost, you go back to home. Go to my page, home page. Now we go to decimal. <coughs> so decimal, I use green, co yellow color. Remember, decimal is yellow. And also, everything of this website, I made it. So everything is my own image. All the pictures, that green leaf is my um is the kala lily leaf and the lemon is my lemon tree but it seems not so effective maybe i will do a cut lemon for this picture and uh, i will i am still on the stage of uh, of uh, improving so decimal lesson decimal lesson i didn't put much yet will be there and the decimal exercise, decimal rounding, and uh, decimal multiplication. Today I am going to keep on working on the, so keep working on uh, making videos and making these exercises. So one of the things I do when the decimal become complicated or when the problem, when this set of problem become complicated or sometimes 
it's easy for us or easy for you, but complicated for other people. Or it is easy for others and complicated for me anyway. I put video in it and uh, I make a brief video that is relating exactly to the concept of this particular exercise and uh, I put it in so um, when you do the exercise do not go ahead to do the exercise walk it through scroll it through if you find this you can click first to watch it or you can click when you have problem watch a video this video no more than five minutes because I want students to take the, to, to, to use the most effective time. It's not for sleep video. This is these are not ASMR video. These are the video educational video. These are not AN, ASMR video. These are educational videos. Okay, so <coughs> uh, these are the the, the decimal part, let's go, we can click this decimal exercise, it will pop up in another wi window, you can fill in the test and uh, submit, it requests an, an email because uh, <coughs> I need to keep a record of my student, and, uh, yeah that's it. Uh, so that I can I can follow up. You are doing good where you are missing, and uh, so this is the decimal uh, multiplication. I can click close it because it goes up to another window. This one we can also close it. You cannot go back with these exercises. Okay, this is a decimal. And now we go to <coughs> measurements, and all this is, uh, top bar it's uh, everywhere is connected. There is not a single page that you do go you go anywhere that you cannot find anything. They are all there. So measurement is relatively complicated. And uh, I use the pink color. This pink color is the color uh, camellia from my my tree. <laughs> so lessons, there are some lessons, measurement conversion. And because I have 20,000 videos, so it's not that uh, I do not put it in. It's the choosing of video will take a lot of time. So... To make it simpler, I actually just make some some new video to go with it. And uh, for exercise, here are the exercise. Mm -hmm. So here, <laughs> I remember there was one time and uh, I watched a video, an artist teaching about, uh, about painting. And it was a wonderful painting. She must be from uh, UK and her, her very English accent, and just beautiful accent, such a lovely lady. It popped up to my uh, recommendation. And then at the end, she has bloopers. And uh, hello, dear class, this, this, this video and those kind of things. And one of the bloopers just made me crack me up so much. She was doing the recording and uh, her husband was doing brush, uh, brushing the, 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 the teas and making coffee, goo, 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 the sound. I am thinking, yeah, this is exactly what is happening in my household. So you, you will hear the cooking sound, the utensil sounds. I am sorry for that. Okay, so measurement is red color. Remember, measurement is a red color. And you go to these uh, measurements, you will find the exercise, the exercise, and with videos in it, with videos. And you can 
click. 好，同学们，杨老师这里有好多漂亮的珠珠。So these are the the the. Oh oh, sorry. You can just go directly to. You can go to YouTube. And if you blow it up, or you do not go to YouTube and watch inside here, watch inside there, inside there, and do the exercise. So that's about、uh, the measurement. Measurement. I have twelve, ten exercise. I think I have the most exercise in fraction section already twelve. So this you can see. To make a differentiation, sometimes I add a Chinese word. I cannot. This is the title of、uh, of my exercise of my Google form. I cannot make it too long. It's not an explanation. I want to make sure I get to understand right in front. So, 呃，代分数 which means mixed number. So it's a fraction multiplication with mixed number, but with mixed number it might be too long as a title. So use one Chinese word explain very well. 真分数 pure、um, fraction. That's、uh, including including、um, 假分数 in English is uh, is uh,、um, oh gosh suddenly. Got my mind blank. 假分数 It's a oh mixed number and、uh, mixed number and.、Uh, 代分数 mix number fraction not illegal fraction oh my gosh fraction 假分数 <laughs> That's exactly what is happening. <laughs> okay, I think when I talk, it will cover up a little bit of、uh, the background noise. That is home. That is working from home. <laughs> And this is weekend. I do not need to make this、uh, video, but ja fu shu. Fraction and、uh, fraction. Let me stop it here. Okay, what is going on? 假分数 Let me find it out. 假分数 No, this is Chinese input. 假分数，假分数。Improper fraction. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! What is going on in my mind? Yes. Ha ha ha! Improper fraction. Okay. So, 真分数 is a a pure fraction. That is, the denominator is bigger than the than the numerator, and 假分数 is the denominator is smaller. Anyway, so we come back to so 真分数除法 It's a proper fraction. Proper, proper, properly say. Okay, so <clears throat> geometry. Let's come to see the geometry. Geometry lesson. 
Did I put anything? Oh, yes, I put a geometry les lesson. So that is actually a Google form. That is very good. Let's play it. You can just play it here. Go, go. This is a geometry. These are the, 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 the Google form. Let's play it full screen. I think I can do it full screen. Oh, yes, blow it up. How good is that? Symmetry. And this is a click based. When you click on the next page, it comes up. And if you have a mouse, if you have a mouse, you do this way, it goes down, goes down. And if you go up, it goes back, goes back, goes back, goes back. Apple mouse. Yeah, sometimes it's quite powerful. So go up, down, down, symmetry. Did you see? This is up and down symmetry, up and down symmetry. And how many symmetric lines you have? How many lines of symmetry, axis of symmetry? If it is a regular shape, which means each side is the same, it has however size, however, how many sides, how many line of symmetry, three points, one, two, three, five points, one, two, three, four, five, four, four, and this one, the s symmetric lines only here, symmetric lines only here, or the line of symmetry, and this one, line of symmetry is here, line of symmetry is here, here or here, yeah, two line of symmetry. And this one, this one, I draw it. Can you believe it? I draw it on my on my iPad. So now uh, my iPad used to be for art production. Used to be for art production. Now it becomes. Uh, now it becomes my mass production. See, it all my mass formula. Because if I use mass, it uh, mathematics, it will be, oh, this is my drawing. I love it. I want to show you this. Look at it. I did this uh, digital painting. Yeah, anyway, let's come back. So I draw it on my um, iPad. So it takes much less uh, uh, cyberspace. I can make it the screen. I can make it into a very, very low pixel, um, low pixel document only for m this kind of something like 300 pixel by 400 pixel. That uh, small size. So each of this image takes about uh, 10 to 20 KB, um, 20 K byte comparing comparing if you do a screenshot or if you do a, a picture it will be something like um, one million pixel so we do not have that uh, luxury anyway even if we have that luxury we do not waste space it does not need to be that big so i made this drawing so how many line of symmetry we have this one does not even have one. This one has three. This one does not even have one. This is a scalene triangle. This one is a quadrilateral shape. One, two, three, four. None of them equal to each other. So it's a no line of symmetry, no line of symmetry. Trapezoid. You can see the the, the resolution is not that good, right? But it's okay. It does the job two line uh, equal because one, two, when you have two dots here, it means uh, they are the same. And uh, I bring this mathematic language into class as early as possible, as much as I can, so that when later on they see, they, they know this is uh, equal. So this has no, no line of symmetry. This one has one line of symmetry from here. I actually can do this. I can use my little mouse, little laser. Uh -oh. 
Uh-uh. It's actually not as good as not even using it. Anyway, so whenever I click, it uh, it goes to the next page. So your project, it can be, you can do a drawing, a painting on origami or Lego. So some example you can get inspired from, and that is. So that is the lesson for for uh, symmetry and uh, the exercise for symmetry. I do not have a, 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 a lesson for geometry. For exercise for geometry, I have uh, angles and degrees. For example, what is this angle? What is this degree? And this I use iPad to, to make. This we can close up, come back. And angle and degree, angle and degree. What is this angle? The degree of this angle, 180 plus 30, it will be 210, right? So later on you submit the answer. And for geometry, I made it uh, uh, geometry, this is symmetry. I borrowed some um, online uh, pictures from from Google Google can produce can 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 allow you to to browse through their uh, data form and the picture picture base picture um, picture storage picture uh, reference picture resources so you get a lot of it and still, Google is one of the most powerful. Other places does not have that many. Mm. Is this painting symmetric? No. Is this painting beautiful? Yes, it's perfect. Art and mathematics. There is coherence, there is a difference. If we make everything symmetric, then life is boring. Because of this, uh, this asymmetric, shapes and expression. It brings our focal point and it brings a more interesting a more interesting structure layout of the painting and brings us the the attention to a particular to a particular object. Or subject, okay. So this is it, and uh, geometry. I have all these are, are clickable. You can you can actually leave this page. Yeah, you can click on this shapes. <coughs> so what is the name? I did a. Uh, 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 Shape one. Oh yeah, another thing I did is in Yahoo, uh, Kahoo. I did a lot of uh, things on Kahoo. Okay, so the next one is test preparation. Test preparation is kind of a, a taboo, taboo uh, um, in in school in education because every school wants to say they are not a pre test preparation school but this is so much needed in a lot of places so i did my test preparation um, exercise exercise are the google forms and i have not yet <coughs> uploaded lessons on my sat video and this i will slowly put it up and uh, and those exercises are this kind of gray, you see the gray color, these are the word problems. Those word problems I need to look through again and correct and uh, make it uh, maybe adjust a little bit. But anyway, this is my website, color-coded, color-coded according to and everywhere is browsable. If there is nothing, it's because I have not yet put it in. It's a dynamic form, always uploading, always uh, updating. 
And uh, today you see it this, next time you may see a different picture because this is not that uh, easy to see. I may be changing into only the tree trunk part. So that is not so confusing. Make uh, it uh, a little bit. See the, the, the fraction part. Uh, no, fraction. Fraction is the blue sky from my backyard. Oh, look at it. Maybe more contrast will be better. Anyway, the measurement has the most beautiful. No, everyone is beautiful, but the most user-friendly design, I think. And it is also a mobile. Um, you can also go to a mobile website, go to your iPad to see it. So... This is my website. Okay. My organization, istp.org, Haiying's Mass Class, Haiying's Mass Class, and you can just go to Haiying's Mass Class without the, the, the leftover uh, tails. You go there, see, this is my class. Okay. Thank you very, very, very much. I love you. I really do. If you have any suggestion, bring it up. I, I am uh, correcting it. I am updating it, and uh, it will be, it will be, uh, it will be a lot of things in it, and uh, it will be, if you stay at home, and uh, and if you're. Uh, you have children need some homeschooling to learn about math and uh, mathematics. These Google Forms, all these exercises could be very, very helpful for them to get uh, um, to get a concept or to get uh, a review of things. So this is my review. I use this to to gorge my. Uh, teaching to gorge my uh, my class progression. If everyone does good on one particular, I will do it less and uh, and uh, do more of this uh, speed up exercise. If everyone does good, I do not need to. Okay, let's come to my Kahoot form. I do. Kahoot! I have some games on Kahoot. I need to sign in, sign in with my um, Google. Give me one minute. Okay. So now have I have signed in. So in Kahoot. You can discover. You can discover. For example, you are learning about um, symmetry. Then there are many, many, many games of symmetries, and see a lot of wonderful teachers. A lot of people have shared. Let me see if I can find myself. Yang Hai, Ying, or maybe Hai Ying Yang. Oh my gosh, I find these are my games. Ma games. These are my games. I made these games. Shall we play one of these games together? <coughs> so how many games do I... Uh, how many questions? Now I find that uh, questions, some easier, some, uh, 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 some difficult. One of uh, the things I made for... This is the new game. Let's go there. The new game, I make it only a, a 20 question at a time. Because by signing up, by students writing their name, it takes time. And uh, if you have only five or six games, it does not even worth it. 20 game, not too long, not too short. So this is one of... Uh, the successful one. I have done one game in class that was a shape kind of game and uh, that was the first time I introduced that class in 
uh, in in to my students, and the students was uh, still young and rough in this uh, in these games. So <clears throat> I got uh, uh, I got uh, um, my boss saying that I did wrong thing. So. Anyway, so I stopped using Google for long uh, for for Kahoo for a long time, because um, that time it was not doing good. Now this time students ask me to do this Kahoo game, so I say why not? Let's uh, let's do it. So you can teach it or you can assign it. You can assign it by giving a certain time and uh, create a game pin. And if you play it, <coughs> you need a player. Now let's do. A, a, we will do a preview. Okay, come back. I I do not need to to correct it. I can just uh, go with it. And uh, so this still this game. We will preview it. Preview. I think preview. You can. You can try it as a real game. So I put on the class class mode and start. And there is a game pin. I need to get another device. Everyone in my class gets a second device. So let's do exactly so. And you go to Safari. You do not want to see what I have on Safari, right? Okay. Uh, you do not need to sign in anything. Just go to Kahoo, Kahoo, Kahoo. Okay, Kahoo. And uh, I agree. I think you must agree. Sign in for free. Why do I need to play a game? Play. You can click on the play just uh, without even signing in. So here is the game. Oh, you do not see. Okay. You do not need to sign in in Kahoo. You just uh, find the play and put in the game pin 7794108. Enter. Okay, nickname, nickname, let me put Haiying. I ask students to put their uh, real name or at least something I can recognize. Okay, we can start. Oh, you can, you actually do not need, you can just play here. Anyway, I have named this shape. This is what? This is a hexagon cube quadrilateral, right? So you press quadrilateral. <coughs> One, I got it right. And the teacher used the laptop. Ooh, I got 500 points. 这条叶子有几条对称轴? You press here. Go. I'm correct again. I'm the teacher. 这个图案有几条对称轴? One, two, three, four. It has a four equal points, so it's four. Let's see. Ha ha, I'm right. And it's timed. Sometimes it's time for uh, 20 seconds. Some You can see here the time. It, see, 19 seconds. This question has um, 20 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight equal side, equal points. So it's actually eight, not four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, oh, I missed that. The correct answer is eight. So if you are slow, you may even miss it. Okay. So it's sometimes it's quite stressful. And um, this one, 
I, oh, oh, I need to press here. I need to, I use this one. I need to press here. So for this exercise, I put in Chinese, Chinese word because some students are better in Chinese. Some students are better in, uh, in language. Some students are better in number. This way, everyone has a chance to, to exercise their strengths. So this one really did very, very, very good. And it has a sound. It sometimes becomes quite uh, annoying. <laughs> So when you are singing, you have this, this music played and it becomes quite annoying. So I will skip all this and we go to, okay, gosh, it takes too much time. We will not play it. At the end of each game, there is a podium. I like that. Anyway, I also use Kahu to to do this. Another thing is Quizlet. Shall we go to Quizlet? Why not? Quizlet. Quizlet. So I have all these games. When you go to Quizlet, you do not need to sign in. Click on the Ku 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 Lows Yang Hai Ying. And you will find I have created 25 already, and uh, which some are studied, some are folders, classes, and through the years I have created some for Chinese, from some for math. And uh, so, for example, this one has 22 forms. And, um, and on the laptop, it's not easy. You can do flashcards you can learn one by one and you can take a test you can write you can spell you can test and do a match or do a gravity match is like this the match game is much easier to play on the on the side oh they are improving round to 10 this you press this together Round to one decimal place. Oh, that is so good. They have improved a big time. Round to one decimal place. It's good. Nice. Round to one. Two ones. See? And play again. Because I have 20 terms, you need to play again. Instead of play again, we can come to this game. Okay, go back. You can do gravity. Gravity, I think, is pretty fun. And um, all starts, start, let's just go. Medium or easy start game. Oh, gosh. Type the answer to one decimal place, 3.2. Go. So I am right on this. And uh, two, one decimal place, 2.2, two go. Yeah, so I entered. Otherwise, until the end, oh gosh, they make it so pretty. Oh, anyway, so this is uh, this, and you can host it live. I have not yet tried host it live. Oh my gosh, next time, next time. It's too new here. And you can do a test. For the test, I recommend students not to do ooh, ooh. for the test. Where is the test? Oh, there is a way to. <clears throat> you can design the test with writing or not. I do not do the right part. The test. Mostly, I let them to do the, the written question might be very difficult because um, if you type in the answer, you may type in it wrong because you have one space or it's too much more about technical things to, to
to discourage people. So matching is very interesting. So this is matching. So we type in this is e. Just type in e. Yeah, this one is kind of, and the multiple choice is easier. Is more effective, the less discouraging, because typing there is other elements, be not mathematically, to to discourage students. Anyway, so these are the things I do in class, and uh, because I'm a bad teacher, oh, this may not be so good to say, because I'm very incompetent in my teaching, so I have to learn. And this is the way that I improve myself to catch up with, uh, with uh, the excellent teaching practice in my school and to catch up with the wonderful teachers in my school team. And um, the, the, the slow bird or the... The, 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 the not witty bird starts first. So this is a Chinese saying. If I am not start smart, the only way can save me is to work hard. So this is what I have done. And uh, sometimes it gets good result in class. Sometimes it does not. It does not. Although you paid effort, it does not necessary guarantee a success. So another lesson in life, go back to my homepage, another lesson in life, do not be discouraged if you are making effort but you are not getting the right result. A lot of time it may not be your problem. It uh, it is the problem of many things, many elements. Make your effort, do not give up. That's, that is as much as you can do. Still there are people do not like my teaching and think I am an incompetent teacher. And I, I still think I'm uh, not other people. I, I am an incompetent teacher, but... Um, but I enjoy it. It's like, uh, it's like, uh, what do I say? There, there are, there are these kind of people. They are so incompetent. They are so lame. They are so lousy, but they enjoy that thing so very much. And that is exactly me. I am so incompetent. I'm so lousy. I'm so silly. I'm so not good. But I. <laughs> Nobody can take away the joy of me enjoy my silliness, my lousiness, my incompetency, my... <laughs> low, the high minus high, the low. Low, the high, high, the low. <laughs> okay. Enjoy your lousiness. Oh, that should be my <laughs> my logo. Add logo. <laughs> Not uh, my logo. This m might be my new um, um, motto. <laughs> instead of uh, not instead of uh, accompanied with uh, be happy every day, be silly every day, enjoy life, enjoy every day. Are we in the right Zoom? Enjoy your lousiness. Yes, I will do it. Enjoy your lousiness. Bye bye, friends. I love you. I really do. Do, 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 do. However lousy I am, it does not diminish a millimeter, a nanometer of my love for you. <laughs>